Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I uh, hope you're doing good. The video for today is how to get a job in Dubai. Now this is the topic which people have literally messaged me on Instagram and asked me to make a video on it. So here it is. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not done that yet. I'm going to share a lot of bonus tips with you guys throughout this video. So how to get a job in Dubai. So getting a job in Dubai is not that difficult and it is not that easy. So if you apply from your hometown, there are pros and cons for that as well. And if you come to Dubai, it is so i am going to tell you and answer all of these questions of yours so the first thing you have to know about uh, uae is do you actually have scope in uae for your jobs or not now each one has a different uh, field if you're already doing a job you need to you know that uh, you might get a job in dubai you might not get a job in dubai how it is going to go so personally do is wherever i am looking for a job for opportunity i go on linkedin i do type data analytics and the location and number of opportunities i see in last seven days that technically gives me an idea that per week if there are like let's say 10 opportunities per week coming out every day one which increases the chance of me getting hired within a month or two max if you are looking for digital marketing and uh, there are lesser jobs, lesser number of jobs per week, then you need to reconsider, right? So I think uh, you should uh, give it a shot. Coming to Dubai, staying is going to be a bit expensive. So if you have that kind of money with you, go ahead. But if you feel like, no, I would not want to take that big step, that big challenge, you need to consider. But if you have a lot of opportunities and you feel you can come to, uh, to Dubai, give it a shot, try. If you have work from home and your organizations do allow you to work from home for Dubai, come to Dubai first, apply for jobs, see if you get it. And if you do, sort it. Now, how do you apply for a job? What is the resume format? Which all websites you need to use? I am going to help you with each and every uh, process of this. So the first step, the very basic and the very important first step is resume. So resume you need to create uh, using, you can create using kick resume, you can create using Word, even Word has a lot of resume templates these days. So if, and if you already have a resume which you feel is up to date, but you want to convert it to a Middle East version, you can do that very simple, very easy. So Middle East resumes are uh, slightly different from the resumes what um, what we generally have in India. Uh, and that is very basic. You just need to uh, add your photo on top right corner. I've shared a URL um, in the description. So you can click that uh, description. You can uh, download that format and convert your resume to that format. If you don't want to do that, just add top right corner your uh, photo and that should be very much similar to Middle East uh, resume. Also I would want you guys to know just try uh, just don't add your passport number no one's looking for that passport number is a very personal information you don't have to share it with each and everyone now your resume is going to go to 10,000 people. So you don't want each and every one of them to know your passport number. It's not needed. If companies need your passport, they will ask you for it. And uh, you can give them a Xerox or uh, documentations. They will mostly ask just for the visa process. So yeah, so resume just needs to have your professional career information and top right corner your photo. Uh, you don't even have to actually mention the location you're staying in Dubai because Dubai is pretty very small. 30 40 minutes we are from one corner to another corner of Dubai step two now step two is uh, where you need to apply for your jobs how you should apply for your jobs now there's no need to go for paid subscription of job search you can go if you feel like I really need a job but I would just suggest you apply for jobs on uh, free portals you might get a job within a month you might not get a job within a month so don't be discouraged don't be disheartened it's okay things take time good things take more time so just keep just tell yourself it's okay if it's not today maybe tomorrow 
but make sure you're applying try to apply in the morning um, 6 to 8 a.m. Um, I personally feel that's the best time to apply because uh, let's say I am a HR my office starts at 9 so if you've sh shared the mail with me morning 6 to 8 let's say you've shared the mail with me around 8 39 so your number will be you know your resume will be the first thing on my mail and I can uh, have a look around that increases your chance I would not say this will work might work if you're too super lucky so use this uh, bonus tip right <laughs> the job portals which you need to apply jobs are I use LinkedIn for certification it's absolutely free you don't have to pay anything you just have to check your knowledge uh, get the certification and it will automatically add in your profile any tool you're learning any new tool you're learning add that to LinkedIn because sometimes what happens is people are not looking at your resume but they're looking they're trying to find you through uh, LinkedIn on LinkedIn make sure you're changing your location from wherever you are to Dubai so recruiters know that you are in Dubai and you're not outside Dubai right on your resume as well make sure you're writing your current location as Dubai so uh, else if you're not in Dubai done uh, they might not entertain you uh, and it depends actually for the company to company if they're really in a hurry to hire someone they will prefer someone in Dubai and not outside Dubai so you need to just know that if you're in Dubai you have to write your location as current Dubai if you are out of Dubai and you're planning to come now let's say I have a plan to come next week Search for the jobs on LinkedIn. Try to contact those HRs and ask them if they can schedule your interview for next week as you'll be in the office or as you'll be in Dubai itself for next week. There are some HRs who might agree and if they do, you have a job interview lined up before you land in Dubai, right? How cool is that? <laughs> so the first uh, website I would recommend you is LinkedIn. LinkedIn, LinkedIn, LinkedIn. You have to apply on this even if you feel you're not getting response or the response is very slow as compared to other job portals it's okay it's really okay but at least on LinkedIn all genuine job opportunities are there and you are not going to um, miss out on anything right second is indeed indeed.ae this is also one of the best website I feel for the buy job search you need to use that if you're looking in Dubai, Sharjah, Ajman, anywhere in UAE, or Indeed is the second one you should go with. Third, there is uh, Gulf Talent. So many guys, there are so many websites. I will list all of them in my description box. But the three main which I personally use is LinkedIn. Um, second is Indeed. Third is Gulf Talent. Gulf Talent is a important one website. I got my first job through Gulf Talent. You're in Dubai, right? Uh, try to have the local number because the HRs are going to call you and in Dubai, they will call you and they would want to interview within uh, you within a day or two. So in Dubai, it's not like other places that they will take your interview today and after two weeks, they will tell you, oh, I think we would want to hire you now second round. No, that not, doesn't happen in Dubai. If they like you, they might get, might hire you in like two days and third day you have a job, right? So it depends. Now, this depends from company to company. This depends if they are looking uh, to hire someone very desperately. If not, if they have time, Things are going to be smooth, things are going to be slow, which is okay. So don't lose hopes. Try to follow up with the HR, you know where you stand. So it's okay if you're not getting first job selected, second job, so relax. For people who want to uh, apply for jobs from their hometown or should you come to Dubai and apply? Now, both the situations, applying from your hometown and coming to Dubai and applying. Both situations are very different. Because when you are applying from your home, um, now if you are a sole owner, you know how much you are going to save and is it possible for you to come to Dubai and if your company doesn't allow work from home, are you okay to have a job, are you okay to be jobless for next two, three, four months and just in case like 0.1% if you don't get a job, are you okay going back after two, three, four months without a job? you have to consider these points and I'm being very true I'm sorry if I'm being harsh with you guys on this but this is the reality 
if you are at your home you can continue your job linkedin trust me linkedin try for job opportunities try to contact the hrs tell them that you are planning to visit next week you can try to talk to them on and uh, get the interview scheduled if they say the interview is going to be online you can just tell them that okay um, i'm available here you can just let me know and you can take the interview you can beg a job before you come to dubai because a friend of mine she did that so before she came to dubai she did connect to all the hrs she did tell hrs that her husband is moving and he, her husband was moving to dubai so she said that my husband is moving and i just have to come back uh, i have to come with him so i am available from 1st of uh, june let's say to join and uh, they did her interview online everything was sorted by the time she came here she had her own residence visa she had a job so you know struggle for her was very less same thing you can try so over here uh, most of the hrs like at least the people i've come across they clearly mention what uh, salary range they are ready to offer so you before even uh, negotiating you know what their range is so if that range fits perfectly fine for you just say yes and if they say that okay our range is like 5 up to 5 we can pay tell them that you're looking for 5 don't tell them that you're looking for 4500 tell them i'm looking for 5500 if possible there are possibilities they give you that so try to do that okay thank you so much uh, don't forget to subscribe and see you in next vlog bye